Hello, everybody, and welcome to another glorious day in the world of the infected. Um, so last time we reinforced, finished reinforcing the spikes, so now we have a full bristle, full metal jacket hedgehog around the, uh, at the bottom, at least on the outside. Uh, and I think the plan is to work on um, reinforcing the inner ones, but uh, the, at least that way that's going to give us a second layer that they've got to get through that's a little bit harder for them to <coughs> negotiate. Well, a third layer or a fourth layer. Now, have I got my bow on me? Have it be in full? No. Let's go upstairs, get, uh, get the bow. <coughs> and see if that chicken wants to come and stay in our house. Yeah, I can hear you. I'm coming. It's all right. I've got a nice warm house for you. There you are. Yes. Let me have a look and see. Uh, one. Oh, seven. Where did you... And that bush is back. It's determined to live here. <laughs> Every episode, it's a guess to see whether the bush is here or not. I thought I saw him running into that bush. But anyway. Oh, hello, Mike. Where are you, chicken? So... Oh, can he? Oh, there you are. Playing too many games, couldn't remember what the uh, crouch command was for this game. <laughs> anyway, we've got him. We'll bring him back, give him a nice warm home in the, uh, or her, hopefully a her, a nice warm home in the barn. While I'm up there, I'll check on the goat and the food sitch. <coughs> I've got to uh, empty these. We've got two chickens. What have we got? A girl. Two girls. Uh, oh, so the one, <laughs> yeah, of course, the one I just put in was a goat. I need a, 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 a female. So two girl chickens. That means eggs at least. We do need a boy and we need a, a, a lady goat. Now I need to, oh, food. I didn't check the food. It's full, but I do need to take some of these out. Actually, what I'll do is I'm going to replant these, or this one, with something else. Because uh, I've got too many of them. And I have a feeling that if Mike can't... Oh, Mike, if he can't, um, let's get rid of that. Let's just uh, remove that. All right, I have to lift it up. Um, if Mike can't um, put things in the holders, the, the wood holders, it kind of I think it's it makes him glitch out if it, if you've got him on uh, um, tending to the plants. There you go. Now we'll have melon there instead. Uh, how many watermelons have we got? Just the one. That's good. Because we're we're getting overrun with. Oh, what's that? Quite sure what that is. Oh well. 
Um, there's a beer. Did we have a beer last time? I can't remember. But I vaguely remember. I know, I know I've been having trouble with beers, the same as Grojan has, that they just haven't been spawning. So um, I can't remember if we had one last episode or the, maybe the episode before. Let's uh, take a couple of these out and give them to Mike. Oh, not that way, no. Put them down. Harvest them. That's the way. And then go and give them some Mike. That way, hopefully. Yeah, yeah, we did have a beer last episode or the episode before. Mike seems to like melon, so um, if I give him those ones, then he won't eat the green ones that I'm saving for um, making the, the these things. Do you need to take that out? Oh, I've got, let's put the there's all on together. I need to go to the mine and get some more mushrooms. All right. And I want to make a couple of um, vegetable packs. If I've got the onions, yes. One, two. Very good. Uh, tins. Veggie mix. Two. And then. I can hear you, dear. Uh, veggie salad. Oh, did I only make one? Oh no, I made two. All right. And then I might make a couple of. Oh, I suppose I'd better put these back. Put these back. That's the way. Put them back. Canned food. Um, eat one. I need to keep eating them to help my stats move up. <clears throat> I'll keep the um, ration packs for a bit later. I want to... Uh, work my way through some of this so it's not running out so even these ones at the bottom are five hours some of these have only got less than an hour to go so I really do need to start eating them otherwise it's a, a waste ones. That's a fruit one. Which was supposed to go up the top. 21. Oh, that'll do. That one will do. Must have made, made those last episode. I'm getting myself in a bit of a muddle here. I probably don't need it. Hmm. Let me see. I, I do need some meat. I've got a meat there. There we go. Um, yeah, I think I've gone a bit crazy with making the vegetable tins. And the um, <laughs> the ration packs. Anyway, that should keep Mike busy for a bit. Um, and if these turn to biofuel, well, that's all right. He's got enough room to put one or two in. And the pumpkins. 
Yeah, he's got enough room to put a couple in there as well. <laughs> right. How are we going on the meat rack? Yeah, I, I don't want to kill one of these yet, though, because I don't want to um, uh, have the meat hanging around and then going off. But I think we'll be all right for a year or two here now. Mike hasn't been doing very well with the rocks. I think we must have run out of um, rock within range for him. It doesn't matter. I can take a, a thing down myself. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is take a quick run up the mine. Um, just to um, make sure there's enough biofuel in the extractor. I do need to make another extractor at some point. Oh, come on. This, I really hate them when they puff, puff, and puff. I've been doing playing Medieval Dynasty lately. Um, oh, yes, that's fine. Um, and uh, there you go. I'll take all of those out and take them back with me. And on there, you do have the option to turn off um, stamina requirements, and guess what I did? <laughs> Turned them off. <laughs> it annoys me. Just in case there's a scorpion, I thought I saw one here somewhere. Uh, mushrooms. Since mushrooms never go off, might as well grab some. Oh, here you go. Let's, uh, There we go. Lots of more steel. Well, I think I've got a, nearly a box of steel now. I, I was We made some last episode from what I remember. It's been a few days since I recorded that, so <laughs> might not be remembering right. I might as well get the stones because Mike's on strike. need to remove him from rocks and get him back to repairing although that might glitch him out again all right mushrooms where's the mushrooms gone usually around the scorpions be nice if you could just hit the scorpions with your axe your pickaxe and <laughs> get rid of them that way that's what i like about what i'm enjoying about medieval dynasty i can hit things that attack me with my axe or pickaxe and they will take damage not as much as they would do from actual weapons but uh, yeah it's still if you've got it in your hand it makes a difference just to be able to whack them and do damage There's, yeah it seemed like that and now it takes a few seconds before I can uh, um, oh, before I can uh, get my spear out and working. There's no quick quick switch in this game. For weapons. My eyesight's not good enough to see the scorpions. Well there's one, I saw him dropping down. Although I don't know where he went. He's hiding waiting for me to go past all unsuspecting like yeah there you go oh 
I made some armour as well. I don't know if I, d if I did that on camera or off camera. Um, whether I did it this episode or... Uh, the, uh, sorry, the last episode or the one before. Um, but I was just going through the boxes, trying to sort them out a bit more. And I noticed the, um, that I had so much Kevlar, I figured I might as well use it. So I did. I don't need lead at the moment. The box is full of lead. What I'm just doing is looking for mushrooms. Oh. Pumpkin growing in the entrance. Don't really need the stuff I'm banging away here either. I will take the lead if I've got an iron ore so I can make it into steel because I want to change the some of the walls, some of the wooden walls for um, glass eventually. So it won't hurt to have a whole stack of steel. And the, I probably will need steel for other things like gates and um, machinery and stuff like that. And I need to think about um, the electrics. I mean, we put the um, uh, blueprints up a couple of episodes ago, but uh, I haven't actually done anything about making stuff yet. So I suppose it's all got to do with the, the light and noise factors. I saw that one coming, but Um, I couldn't uh, hit him. <laughs> um, yeah, so it's it's all, I guess, getting a balance between light and noise, and and the and the subsequent attacks resulting from that. Oh, there was a double rock there. Never seen that before. And uh, I think that's enough. Now oh, let's take this one while we're on the way out. Might as well. Silly to walk past it. And if I'm going to be making batteries... It... Oh, of course. <laughs> that one thing. Let's throw the, those away. Yeah, that just... Silly things that take you over the limit. Um, yeah, um, I was just saying, I, if I could take some lead, if I'm going to be starting on electrics and batteries, I'm going to need lead. You poor thing, I know. It's, I'm asking too much for, of you, aren't I? Is that a chicken? Yes. I'm overweight. And there's a goat. And I can't run away. <laughs> That's all right. Yeah, you go to sleep. <laughs> that was a mistake. Right, let's drop a bit of stuff in the... Um... Oh. No, in here, then. I'll come back for it in a minute. I think I can hear another goat, or it might be a sheep. Um, but I need to get a, a trolley to carry the goat upstairs. 
and I know there's a trolley here. Got wood in, though. I don't know what I'm going to do with the wood. Oh. Oh, I'll do Mike's trick. Chuck the wood on the floor. I'm going to pick it up after I've put the goat in his nice warm house. So a goat and a chicken. In a minute or two. Probably should have a mini health kit as well. <laughs> the attack of the goats and scorpions. All right, let's uh, get these two babies to bed. I'm hoping this one's a boy one. Yes. And I'm hoping this one's a girl one. Yes! <laughs> Brilliant! Okay, let's put the scorpion meat here to dry. Mushrooms in here. Seeds in here. Somewhere. <laughs> there. Um, I'll put this smelting stuff here while I'm up here. Might as well pick up the logs as well. I should make another trolley. What was I doing? Putting away the... oh, that's downstairs. Well, there's a trolley. <laughs> I'd forgotten I had that one. Let's leave this here for now. Um, lead. There's no room. Iron. One of the rest must be downstairs. Copper. Oh, what about cobalt? Copper? No, that's not copper. Aluminium. And I guess I might put the, the lead ore in here just for now until I've made it into things. Take this. Oh, I don't want to take it downstairs just yet because I want to take this one downstairs so it's easy. Oh, there's a bear in it. That's the one with the bear. <laughs> All right. I'm getting myself in a muddle here. Right, let's take this downstairs then. Oh, it's in the way upstairs. Let's take this stuff out of here. Oh. Well. I didn't I didn't uh, notice that infection before. Oh, well it's not an infection. It's just go to tech. All right, let's put these upstairs. Oh, hello. What are you doing there? Oh, sorry, I haven't got any room for you upstairs. <laughs> um, oh, bandages, that's what I'm doing. First aid, that's up in my bedroom. I'm going to eat one of those. And I'll take 
couple of those. A couple of those. Right. Back down to the smelting room. These go in the rocks. I've got fragments. I'll put, that, I'll put them in the bottom one. Um, and the lead needs to go in the top till I've made steel. Um, iron. Cobalt. Clay. Yeah, you're going to drive me nuts, aren't you? <laughs> uh, maybe I should make two trolleys. If I've got the... Um... Yeah, I've got enough nails. Right. Two trolleys. Uh, others. One, two. Don't know where I'm going to put them all, but anyway. Three dogs. I thought it was only two for a trolley. Oh well. Here, my dear. I've got a nice warm trolley for you to lay in. Have a little sleep, and I might stick you down here because I really don't have room upstairs for you. Um. Sorry. I'm sorry. I oh, know, you weren't doing any harm. I feel really mean when I kill things. I can hear another chicken. Not sure I need another chicken, but I probably wouldn't hurt. Just in case. Although I might not have enough the space if they have a baby. Let's not bother with that. Give me a goat. Yeah, there you go. That'll do. Run. <laughs> Run. All right. I'm good on you, Mike. You are. You're finally doing the... Are you doing logs or are you doing pumpkins or... Watermelons, okay. We don't need any more watermelons, Mike. Where did I put the other trolley? Must be down here still. Oh, there's a log in it. <laughs> Mike, we need logs now. Is it's firewood? <laughs> Sorry, Mike. Were well, you a boy or a girl? A girl? A girl and a boy. So we might have baby goats sometime. Oh, that's not very good. Let's uh, straighten it up. 
<clears throat> Excuse me. Just a minute. 